Hi everyone, welcome to Saturday Craft. Did you listen to our story this week? Daniel and his friends had a diet of only vegetables. So I thought today we would use some vegetables, a carrot in particular, to make something that shows Daniel still growing strong even though he only ate vegetables. So this is what you need. You need a toilet roll tube or half of a kitchen roll tube. If you're worried about germs or anything like that, just pop it in the microwave for 10 seconds and it will be fine. You need a yogurt pot. I've got this one. You need a carrot. Now you don't need a whole carrot. You just need the top of a carrot. I'm gonna cut mine off about here in a minute. So next time you're cooking something with carrots or you have some yummy carrot sticks to eat or something like that, ask if you can keep that top bit and use it. Then you will need some colouring pens or pencils and a glue stick and you can make a Daniel who grows carrot hair. Are you ready? Let's have a look at what we can do. Okay, so I'm starting off with my yogurt pot and my toilet roll tube. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut a bit of this yogurt pot off to make a little dish. That's what my carrot part is going to go in. So you might need to get an adult to help you with this bit because it is quite tricky. I've got to poke my scissors through the yogurt pot and that is a little bit tough. So please get a grown up to help you with this bit. There we go, I'm going to cut around like this. So it is quite tough. There we are. And then I'm just going to check there's no sharp bits left on my pot because I don't want to catch my fingers on anything. So here we go. I have this little bit of yogurt pot. Now I'm going to take my toilet roll tube and I'm going to cut some little slits in the top all the way around like this. I'm not going very far down, only a little way, kind of like that. And they don't need to be super close together. I'm going to go all the way around and this is going to help us to stick our yogurt pot on top. Okay, so once you've gone all the way around, it will look a bit like this. And now I'm going to bend these pieces down like this. There we go, and I'm going to put it on the table like this and use the table to really flatten those edges. Now I can put some glue all the way around these pieces and that will let me stick my yogurt pot on top like this. go I'm all gluey and the yogurt pot goes on top like that I'm just using my fingers to really make sure it's stuck on there we go okay so this is gonna be Daniel, I'm going to do a face for him up here and maybe some clothes down here and this can be kind of like his hat and then in a bit we're going to put a carrot in the top and I'll show you how you can use it to grow some hair. But for now I'm going to decorate my Daniel. Okay, so here is my Daniel is a bit tricky too. Oh, goodness me, his head fall off. Now that uh, serves me right for not waiting till my glue dries properly, doesn't it? So here is my Daniel. It's a bit tricky to draw on the cardboard, but I think I did an okay job. And now you just need to wait until next time you have some carrots to eat. Thankfully, I'm having some carrots tonight. So I've got my carrot here. Please check with a grown-up before you go using any kind of knife. Don't go taking a sharp knife out the drawer or anything like that. I know you guys are much too sensible for that, but just in case anybody's not. Now, the only bit of your carrot you need is this top bit. So I'm just going to cut a bit off 
like that. That's kind of the bit we don't usually eat anyway. That bit usually goes in the compost or in the bin. So hopefully the grown-ups in your house will be perfectly happy for you to have that. And all you've got to do with that top of your carrot is to pop it into Daniel's hat and then put some water in. You don't want to drown your carrot, so you don't fill it all the way up, but fill it about halfway up. And then over the next week or couple of weeks, your Daniel will sprout some hair, if you're very lucky. It will be some very green leafy looking hair that comes from eating your vegetables, just like Daniel did. So there we go. Here is my finished Daniel. He's got his carrot in the top there, ready to grow some hair. And I will show you in a couple of weeks time, maybe next week if it's grown by then, what his hair looks like. But I think he's gonna grow lots of leafy green hair. And I will see you tomorrow for Family Sunday. Bye.